Well, good morning, buddy. I'm going to have to put your toys up in a little while. So you ready for a little treat this morning? You ready for your morning? <coughs> you are? <coughs> and then we'll go to the car. And you can hang out there and get your treat. You want to get those children to go walk around? A poo? A little. A little. A little. Thank you. And you can go out there and, you know, run around and play. Care of your business this morning. I'm getting it. Whoop. And my hand got stuck in the box, George. It did. It got stuck in the box. Now, would you like one or two? Is that one? Says big boy or two? <laughs> There you go, two it is, sir. Oh, you dropped it. <laughs> All right, you eat that and then we're ready to go, sir. It's a beautiful book. Oh, morning. George out here. Having to smell where all of his friends have been, I'm sure. I'm sure you're over smelling now, going, yep, that's one of them. <laughs> Was I right? <laughs> Was it? <laughs> huh? You smelling where your friends have been? Have you missed the party this morning? Everybody already been out here, huh? Yeah. Good boy. And a wave, he's been a wave too. Huh? Hey, it's frosty out here this morning, isn't it, boy? Yeah? See all your buddies that's been around? Yeah. What are we going to do today, Sarge? Huh? I know we got to do a little work. Yeah? We'll be doing some work, and in between work, I guess we used to be playing. Because that's how we like to do it. Yeah? Because our motto is, have a little fun as you go. <laughs> I know. You're so correct, sir. I always walk around with stuff in my pocket. Because if he's doing the right thing and a good thing, I'm going to give him a treat. And uh, the things that he knows really well, you know, he no longer needs a lure, you know, to get him to do it. Hi, buddy. Good morning. Tell everybody hi. Hey, little. You know how much you say this morning? Huh? Can you do it in a little voice? Little? Okay. There you go. Good boy. Well, he knows. Where are you jumping and going, buddy? Trying to hand it to you. Buddy. Hiya, buddy. Hey, it's gonna be a good day. It's almost Christmas. Have you been have you been naughty or not? I already know the answer to that. I guess it it's kind of a coin toss for you on which it's gonna be. <laughs> I'll have to sit down and look at the record on this one. Yeah. But I'm sure. You'll get something, my dude. Whoa, my bad. Hey, my bad. <coughs> Good job. Right, we'll figure out something, huh? You got it, buddy. You'd sit there and just have me throw treats all day long, wouldn't you? I believe you would. Shoot, if I was you, I'd probably sit up there too and have somebody throw me treats all day long. Man, 
more plants. I do love food. <laughs> Why don't we go to my bad? I'm sorry, buddy. I might have to go get coffee this morning. Huh? Easy there. That's like your favorite thing to do. Even when I'm not asking you to do it, you somehow or another will manage to get up on the car. Even that really big one over there. Can you wave? Hey, wave. Yeah. Good job. Good wave, buddy. Well, Sarge, I guess I should have brought one of your toys down here. Because Lord knows. We know you're not going to play. We like to play that ball over there. Anybody else's toys. Can't do it. That's just not your thing, is it? You got to have your toys or no toys at all. My way or the highway, huh, buddy? Sorry, I don't even know how you're getting up there like that. Look at all that frost on this car. Hey, there's a lot of frost on that tire. You sure is, buddy. Yeah, I don't want you to slip off. No, I don't. Well, you just can't help yourself. You just hop right back up there. You're doing an excellent job, I must say. If there's a tire hopping reward, or award, I mean to say, you would probably get it, sir. Yeah. Why don't you go do something else? Huh? You can go roam around and smell where your friends have been. Ease your mind, buddy. Not everything's work. Go we'll have some fun somewhere. Sarge there, he's the fourth blue healer that I've owned and I've, I've fostered, you know, a couple of them and I, I tell you what, he started out a foster, he was on Facebook, you know, for sale and stuff and uh, I thought, well, you know, I'll give him, give him some, uh, you know, skill, a little learning, a little bells and whistles and, uh, you know, he would be great for someone. But the more I've seen him and seen his personality and, and, uh, watched how he was I, and watched his extreme and I do mean extreme loyalty you know he's a dog you could I could probably pull over and put him on the side of the road and drive off and he'd still be there the next day you know so I fell in love with with how he was and uh anyway so that's how Sarge came to be and he stays with he's been quite a hand too and a handful yeah we know healers are hard-headed, but you you take it to the extreme of hard head, kind of like that extreme loyalty. Yeah, you do. That's right, buddy. I'm talking about you. 